Hi everyone, I hope you're all well. So, um, I apologise for the lack of videos. As you can imagine, these past couple of weeks have been absolutely manic in um, the run up to moving country, which is happening in two days' time, um, April the 10th. I am more excited now, um, but it's still very daunting. I've also been really ill, as you can probably tell. I've had this horrible chesty cough, cold thing that literally just won't budge. So, my voice sounds like this so I'm really sorry about that. Can I just say um, a huge thank you to everyone that responded to my uh, moving to Singapore video. The response has been unreal. I've had so many comments. All of you guys are so amazing, wishing me well. I love hearing from you, you know those of you that already live there. You've left some um, amazing tips. My boyfriend were just going through the comments, absolutely loving reading them so thank you so much for that um, and I can't wait to bring you guys along as I said. I thought I'd quickly pop in a March favourites. Um, it's a bit late on the old March favourites, but um, still I thought I'd show you what I've been enjoying in the month of March. And then you've got something to watch because, let's be honest, videos have been a little bit lacking on my channel lately. So I thought I'd quickly get this up for you. So I'm just going to go ahead and get started. So I was rummaging through my makeup kit and I came across <coughs> the 17 Instant Glow Shimmer Brick. And I had kind of forgotten about this product, but now I've just been reaching for it like every day. I absolutely love it. This was like four pounds or something crazy. Um, and it is the most amazing bronzer and highlighter combo. It's so gorgeous. It's kind of like a rip off of the Bobbi Brown Shimmer Bricks. Um, but the pigmentation is amazing and I 100% recommend this for kind of spring, summer. You're going to absolutely love it. Um, yeah, so the bronzer is just gorgeous. The highlighter amazing um so you definitely need to go pick that up that is from 17 they have some amazing makeup that brand next up is this kiko smart lip pencil which i have mentioned before but it is in 712 this is the one that's a very similar um shade to max saw lip liner these are two pound fifty each and this is just the perfect daytime color i always pop it on uh, basically every day now. They're really easy to sharpen. This has lasted me really well. I want to grab some more, but I don't know if they have Kiko in Singapore. I would assume not, but if anyone knows, let me know. So yeah, absolutely love that. So I popped into Tesco a few weeks ago and their stationery section is actually really lovely. Um, I ended up picking up this monochrome stripe notebook. I thought it was super cute. Uh, this has kind of been like my run up to Singapore notebook just to jot everything down, make lists or whatever um, and it's just been really handy. This was like £2 but I just thought it was really cute. Also in the stationery section I picked up this pencil case. Um, now for ages I've been wanting um, this Makeup Forever pencil case, uh, well lip, it's like a makeup case for lip liners or mascaras or whatever you want to put in it. And this one was really similar, this again was like £1.50 from Tesco, it's just a pencil case but I've shoved all my lip liners in there and I just think it's the perfect um, thing to carry them in. It's kind of got a sports luxe look to it, I just thought that was really cute and a really handy way to store your makeup. So the lipstick I've been reaching for in the month of March has been my MAC Flat Out Fabulous lipstick which I am actually wearing now. It's so beautiful, it's a retro matte shade so it is quite hard to get on the lips, it's quite I guess chalky. Um, so you really have to push down onto your lips to apply it but it really does stay this is my like eating lipstick so if I know I'm going out to eat or something I will wear this one because I know it will stay on it's more pink than purple um, but it's a bluish tone pink which I absolutely love so it makes your teeth look whiter and that's called Flat Out Fabulous and I recommend it 100% the perfect shade for spring summer so as I was in Sainsbury's the other day I had to pick up a grey nail polish I just had to, I needed one um, and I came across this brand called Eye Candy Core Colours. I absolutely love this. It stayed on for three days and that might sound really stupid to some people but nail varnish just does not stay on my nails. It chips like instantly but this stayed on for three days. It almost looked like I had like a manicure, I couldn't believe it. And it was like £4. This is in the shade Mr Grey which is a really gorgeous um, kind of almost lilac-y grey. I absolutely love it. So I was just amazed to find something that stayed on my nails, to be honest, so I love that. So another favourite of mine this month has been this pair of glasses, which I was kindly sent by Fermu. Um, I've worked with them before. I absolutely love their glasses selection. I think they're great. So I ended up opting for these ones. I will leave the name below and any discount codes in the description box so you can go have a look for yourself. I really like their website. They have 
um, this bit where you can upload a picture of yourself and then select the glasses so you kind of can see what it's going to look like on your face. You just fill in your prescription, it's so quick and easy. And the delivery is so fast, it always takes literally like two to three days for them to arrive. Their frames are so, so cheap, so I would definitely recommend checking them out. I absolutely love these and I was definitely due a new pair. So my final favourite of the month has been my flat tummy tea. Now flat tummy tea got in contact with me um, to ask if I'd like to try some of the tea and I said absolutely. Um, so it's basically a tea to reduce bloating, boost energy and speed metabolism. And I definitely have seen a reduction in bloating. It's kind of something I suffer with quite badly, especially after I've eaten certain meals. Um, I just, I'm always quite bloated, it's really annoying. So there's no tea bags involved, it's basically just fresh from the packet. Um, you pop it in a tea strainer, one teaspoonful, and um, you let it kind of simmer for about five minutes and then you drink it up. And the taste isn't bad at all, it tastes um, quite aniseedy but I don't mind the taste at all. So you've got one packet of tea that you drink once a day in the morning, and then you have um, the cleanse packet of tea, which you're meant to drink every second night before bed, and then after that first week, you drink every third night before bed. Um, so yeah, I've honestly been loving these. It just It's a nice alternative to just drinking normal tea, to think that something's doing your system actually some good. But yeah, I'm not just saying it, I honestly have seen a reduction in, um, in bloating. So if you wanted to give it a try yourself, I'll leave the website links below. Okay guys, so that is the end of my March favourites. I really hope that you like it. Hopefully I'll get this video up before I leave. Um, there's just so much going on. I'm trying to pack at the same time. It's absolutely manic. We've had to say goodbye to everyone. It's been crazy, so bear with me. I will try to get this up um, before I go. And uh, this might be the last time you see my room. So say goodbye. It's so sad. I'm not even going to get into it. As always, thank you for watching guys. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. Um, if you want to keep to up to date with my move and everything like that, then um, you can follow me on social media, Instagram at The Vintage Vision and Twitter at Georgia Caney. Thank you for watching guys and I'll see you soon. Bye. My big news is that I am moving to Singapore, which is insane and I can't really get my head around it at the moment. Um, but yeah, it's all pretty crazy at the minute.